thanks for watching this video. This video is one of three videos that I am dedicating to the concept of warming up. This concept is a very important concept for all of us. Uh, if you've ever taken any lessons or talked to anyone who plays the guitar or anyone who is uh, doing sports, uh, athletes, everybody talks about the concept of warming up. Uh, so to focus that on to what we do uh, as guitarists, I'm going, I was trying to come up with a definition. And here's my definition of warming up. Uh, warming up represents a set of movements that build the mechanical elements of technique, okay? So the idea of warming up, I'm going to say this again, is that warming up is a set of movements that build the mechanical elements of technique. Now, what are these elements that I'm talking about? We essentially have two types of elements. We have a one that has to do with the mystique, the approach to technique, and they uh, are basically the relationship of mind and body when we play. You know, how our mind interacts with the body to create technique, number one. And then the other one, the other element of technique is what I like to call the practical element of technique. And in this practical element of technique is where we find all of the elements that have to do with fingers, what fingers do, for example, what fingers we use, what fingers we use in the left hand, alternation, um, free stroke, rest stroke, slurs, all of these things that we do, they all are, they all fall within the element of the practical. When you take lessons, 90% of your lessons usually will involve the discovery of these elements, the practical elements of playing. Okay, so um, I'm going to show you a simple warm-up warm example in this video. And uh, in the next set of videos, I will discuss what I did in this case. You'll be amazed at how simple this exercise is. And you might think that an advanced player might not really benefit from a simple exercise. But you'd be amazed at how all of, all of this little simple exercise that I'm going to play can provide a great number of possibilities that we can all use. So before I go on and play, play the exercise, I will discuss a couple of things. The first one is that how this exercise can be used. And uh, first of all, for beginners, the idea of the warm-up is going to be very useful, the way this exercise is played, but not necessarily th that imperative. And what I mean is that, um, you know, usually beginners don't have a lot of time to practice the guitar. So if that is your case, then what I would suggest is don't focus too much on the, ex the warm-up exercises. Uh, just focus on playing what your teachers assign you to play. Um, you know, work on, your, work on your pieces and whatever, whatever exercises, whatever method book you're working on. Make sure that you continue playing that. That's going to build good habits and a, a better sense of routine when it comes to playing the guitar. Now, for intermediate players, what is important is um, the idea of what I call self-profiling. And what, what that means is you have to learn to understand what are the weak areas of your playing and what are the strong areas of your playing. So when you warm up, you're, you're constantly looking to use the exercises in a way that they test the weak areas of your playing. Okay, now for advanced players, uh, the idea of warming up involves something that I like to call tailoring technique. And tailoring technique means that you are creating your own exercises from repertoire that you're working on. And the purpose of these exercises is to target very, very specific things that at this point, at the point that you are in, technique methods, technique books can no longer teach. So um, warming up can involve all of, this com all of these components depending what your level you're in. So here I'm going to go ahead and play the exercise. Uh, you'll be, like I said, you'll probably be amazed at how simple it is. And in videos two and three, I will discuss how this exercise can turn into something much more complex that you can use that uh, will be useful for you at any level, okay? So it goes like this.
notice is a very simple exercise. So um, in the next video, I will discuss this exercise, what was it that I did, what I was looking for, and eventually in video three, I will discuss how this exercise can be turned into something much more difficult and much more useful for advanced levels. Okay, well, uh, this is it for this video. Thanks for watching. If you have any comments, uh, feel free to leave a comment in the section below. And, uh, you know, I'll see you in the next video. Thank thanks again.